Hey there everybody, so we are back with another video and in this video uh, we will be reviewing the MIUI GO Plus that has been recently released 2 days back and uh, I've been using this ROM for uh, uh, 2 days already so let's have a quick look of this ROM and uh, let's see how it actually performs in the real world so yes, let's start the review okay, so let's first of all see the change log that the developer has uh, posted so let's go to telegram and uh, if you can see let me uh, clear this reflection and you can see this is based on MIUI 12.5.7 and uh, it provides mock location mock provider and system is uh, completely hidden right then we have 90 fps rate in display settings then we have uh, debloated some system aspects recorder remove MIUI browser and other uh, new game booster and some Japanese font included so these are the change logs that uh, we have with this ROM First of all, uh, I was uh, actually using MIUI 12.04 before this ROM. So uh, the very first thing that I have noticed is the smoothness, guys. Obviously, you will be getting uh, a lot smoother experience than MIUI 12, MIUI 12, uh, as it is MIUI 12.5. And with this new update, 12.5.7 update, the ROM has become a lot more smoother uh, compared to what we uh, used to get in MIUI 12. But one major uh, bug I have noticed is. Uh, as uh, we have a 90 hertz uh, display toggle uh, what I have noticed is whenever we are on 60 hertz no uh, it works completely fine okay it works on 60 hertz that is fine but uh, whenever we switch 90 hertz from 60 hertz what we will notice is it won't switch to 90 see if there is written 60 hertz also uh, the experience is completely 60 uh, let me show you with the power monitor so guys as you can see the ROM is still working on 60 FPS even uh, when we have set it to 90 Hz but yeah what we can do is we can just uh, simply go to settings and uh, what we have to do is just again go to display and uh, set the refresh rate to 90 Hz but as you can see it's still not working let me just switch to dark mode so that you have a better visibility of the frame rate Uh, so again as you can see it's still on 60 fps so to fix this what you have to do is uh, you have to do go to display and uh, you have to go to refresh rate again and switch it to 120 hertz now as you can see the display just switches to 120 fps and then what you have to do is just simply uh, switch to 90 hertz and uh, simply go back to your home screen uh, so it will now uh, start working as 90 s uh, 90 fps or uh, i should say 90 hertz so this is a quick workaround that i have noticed and if the developer is watching this uh, there is uh, still something room for improvement guys now again uh, as the change looks uh, said that there is no MIUI browser you can see there is no MIUI browser i'm using uh, chrome altogether and there are uh, some few MIUI apps are bloated de bloated as well so this is yeah this is uh, I think uh, this is ROM is working really good also you have the MIUI dialer and MIUI message application so you can simply enjoy auto call recording without uh, the other person knowing you that you are recording so yeah this is also a very good feature because this ROM is actually based on MIUI European ROM uh, MIUI EU so yeah you get the MIUI dialer in that also let me just show you that uh, even with magic installed the safety nest is getting fast see so it's a success that means you have your uh, safety net passed also let's check uh, if uh, we have the device certification as well or not so let's go to play store and uh, this is how we can go let's go to settings and as you can see the device is actually certified let me just uh, show you closely so this is device this device is certified also you uh, get the MIUI camera here uh, as you can see that uh, simple MIUI camera that you actually get with all the MIUI ROMs also, I've installed Pixel Cam. Uh, if you want the link of it, I'll be linking it in the description as well. So this is a cool mode that I've noticed, and it really works fine. The pictures are sharp and uh, has a good and enough dynamic range. So yeah, you can also try this mod as well. But uh, let's uh, come to the topic. Uh, this ROM actually feels smooth, guys. Uh, it is working really good. Also, as I already told you that this is based on MIUI 12.5.7. So you get the smoother UI of MIUI 12.5. Also, you have the latest screen recorder. Uh, let me just show you the settings. Wait, 
settings and here you can uh, actually tweak around with your screen recorder settings so yeah this is how screen recorder is also let me show you that uh, it also comes with the latest game turbo uh, let's go to settings and uh, as you can see here we have the latest green turbo and these are the settings that you can play around with so you have a lot of options uh, that you get uh, with the new latest game turbo and uh, trust me guys uh, this game turbo actually provides an excellent gaming performance and i don't know how it uh, does but uh, i've noticed that uh, in each and every new i roam the gaming performance is really really good so one more thing is that guys uh, we also have an option of for memory expansion in that you can go to uh, additional settings and there will be you, there you will see memory extension it by default is turned on guys uh, but one 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 thing i would like to address is uh, you don't actually need uh, more than 6gb of ram guys come on but still if you want to use you have the option guys you can enjoy that okay so this is uh, the quick look of this rom uh, if you like this video guys uh, hit the thumbs up if you have any doubts guys uh, you can just simply ask me in the comment section below and uh, and also if you want to see such content in future you can subscribe to this channel i'll be posting such uh, great content uh, in the near future as well i'll be signing guys uh, thank you bye bye